Have you ever wondered who laid the foundation for our modern understanding of space exploration? Who dared to dream of reaching the stars when most thought it an impossible feat? The answer lies in the visionary mind of one man, Konstantin Tsiolkovsky. Born on September 17, 1857, in the small Russian village of Izhevskoye, Konstantin Tsiolkovsky faced adversity from a young age. A bout of scarlet fever left him with severe hearing impairment. Yet this setback didn't deter him. Instead, he delved into the world of books, teaching himself mathematics, physics, and astronomy. Tsiolkovsky's curiosity and self-driven education led him down a path of groundbreaking discoveries. He is most celebrated for his work on the principles of astronautics and rocketry. His theories from the late 19th and early 20th centuries laid the groundwork for human spaceflight as we know it today. Among his many contributions, the Tsiolkovsky rocket equation stands out. This equation, relating a rocket's change in velocity to its exhaust velocity and the initial and final masses of the rocket, is a cornerstone of modern rocket science. But Tsiolkovsky didn't stop at equations, he dared to dream. He conceptualized space travel, proposing the use of liquid-fueled rockets, multi-stage rockets, and space stations. These ideas, once considered radical, are now fundamental components of space exploration. Additionally, Tsiolkovsky's insights into orbital mechanics, particularly the concept of escape velocity, played a pivotal role in shaping early space missions and orbital maneuvers. Tsiolkovsky's influence goes far beyond his mathematical and theoretical contributions. His visionary ideas inspired generations of scientists, engineers, and space enthusiasts, laying the foundation for the theoretical and practical aspects of space exploration. In his homeland, Tsiolkovsky's legacy is particularly revered. His theories and ideas were instrumental in the development of the Soviet space program, influencing key figures and shaping the trajectory of space exploration in Russia. In retrospect, Konstantin Tsiolkovsky was not just a scientist. He was a visionary who dared to dream about the possibilities of space travel at a time when it seemed far beyond reach. His legacy lives on in every rocket launch, every space mission and every step we take in exploring the final frontier. Indeed, as the father of space science, Tsiolkovsky's contributions continue to resonate, underscoring the importance of audacious dreams and relentless curiosity in pushing the boundaries of human knowledge. Have you ever pondered over the mysteries that lie beyond our Milky Way? What if we told you there's a cosmic neighbor, a twin of sorts to our galaxy, closer than you might imagine? Welcome to the mesmerizing world of the Andromeda Galaxy. Located within the constellation from which it takes its name, Andromeda is a spiral galaxy positioned roughly 2.537 million light years away. It's our closest galactic neighbor, barring a few dwarf galaxies and the Triangulum Galaxy, also known as M33. Andromeda's grandeur is not just in its proximity, but also its size. With a staggering diameter of 220,000 light years, it dwarfs our Milky Way, which measures only around 100,000 light years in comparison. Andromeda's scale is not limited to its size, but extends to its mass as well, weighing in at an estimated 1.5 trillion times the mass of our Sun. This colossal mass comprises stars, gas, dust, and the elusive dark matter that forms the backbone of galaxies. The structure of Andromeda mirrors our Milky Way, with distinct spiral arms unfurling from a central bulge, all enveloped within a disk of stars, gas, and dust. These spiral arms are regions of constant change, bustling with star formation, young star clusters, and nebulae. In contrast, the galactic disk is home to older stars, akin to our Sun, a middle-aged star on the cosmic timescale. The allure of Andromeda has tantalized astronomers for centuries. Its first recorded observation dates back to the 10th century, attributed to the Persian astronomer Abdel Rahman al-Sufi. However, the true nature of Andromeda as a separate galaxy remained elusive until the 18th century. The early 20th century marked a turning point in our understanding of Andromeda, spearheaded by Edwin Hubble. Utilizing the 100-inch Hooker telescope at Mount Wilson Observatory, Hubble studied variable stars in Andromeda. His groundbreaking discovery of Cepheid variables in 1923 provided irrefutable evidence that Andromeda was indeed a separate galaxy far beyond the confines of the Milky Way. Our understanding of Andromeda has grown exponentially since Hubble's time, driven by advances in technology and observational techniques. 
modern marvels like the Hubble Space Telescope, the Spitzer Space Telescope, and ground-based observatories equipped with adaptive optics have given us unprecedented access to Andromeda's intricacies. To summarize, the Andromeda Galaxy, our closest galactic neighbor, is a source of unending fascination. Its vast size, impressive mass, and beautiful spiral structure make it a captivating object of study. From early observations by ancient astronomers to modern studies using state-of-the-art telescopes, our understanding of Andromeda has evolved significantly over the centuries. As we continue to explore the cosmos, who knows what new wonders Andromeda will reveal?